Well, I'm absolutely delighted now to be joined by the leader of the Conservative group here on the LGA, and that, of course, is David Shakespeare. David, thank you so much indeed for joining us today. Now, a lot of talk today about the recession, how local authorities can help to tackle it. Does that not put a lot more pressure on local government? It certainly is, but there's a lot that local authorities can do during a recession. Uh, my own authority in Buckinghamshire was the first in the country to start paying the bills to small companies within 10 days. That's something we, could, uh, we did immediately. Um, we've put a lot of extra money into protecting small businesses. We've set up a £100,000 challenge fund. Uh, and of course, for those people who are losing their jobs, we've also put a similar amount into the Citizens Advice Bureau because that's uh, so much needed. But of course, there is going to be very difficult times ahead. Whoever wins the next general election has got to have a dramatic spending cut to public services. So we're really talking about who's being honest about that and who's not being honest about that. Now you say that, but do you think your leadership is being honest about the need to tighten belts? I think they are, because they're saying quite clearly, uh, do not expect an easy time, the cupboard is bare. And I know they're going to be very supportive to local government, but it's really up to us to make our own balance, uh, books balance. And that means far more intervention on the efficiency side, driving out more costs, very radical new ways of delivering services. All of these have got to come to the top of the queue to keep services flowing to the public. And that's the only way we're going to do it. The solution has to be in our own hands.